mantle is like a light bulb for your gas lantern. And like a bulb, it's fragile and will need changing on occasion, so carry a few spares. Buy the right size and shape mantle for your particular lantern. Ask at a camping store if you're unsure. The key to keeping a fragile mantle intact is packing the lantern well when travelling. We pack ours upright in its original packaging inside our odds and ends box. Check your mantle before use to see that it's not broken. Throw it away if it has a tear or hole as it's unusable and unsafe. A broken mantle will cause a concentrated heat spot which can crack the glass globe. Before you change the mantle, make sure the gas is off at the bottle and the extension pole. Remove the old mantle by cutting it off if it's a string tie or unclipping it if it's a metal tie. The metal clip mantles are easier to get on and off. Tie or clip the new mantle so it fits evenly and securely. If using the string ties, cut off the excess. Form the mantle into a bulb-like shape. A mantle needs to be prepared by burning it in. This may seem unusual to new users. There'll be a flame and smoke, so do it in a well-ventilated area. Use a long match, or our preference, a barbecue lighter. Don't touch the mantle with the lighter as it'll break and you'll need to start again. Just hold the flame below and wait for it to burn up and over. Once shrunk and burned to a white ash bulb, surprisingly, that's when it's ready to use. Slide on the glass globe and secure the lid before using the lantern. Now you can turn on the gas at the bottle. Turn on the gas gently at the pole as you light the lantern. Some suppliers advise it's best to use a match the first time. The safest way we've found is to come in through the top with a long match. Our lantern has a push button ignition which makes lighting every other time so much easier. More information and tips like these from Camping in Style.